Yeah? Hello, good day. Here we are in Guatemala, just uh, in eastern Guatemala near the border of uh, Honduras, uh, where, uh, where I've come to do some, some research and, uh, and agricultural research and create some models of, of development. Uh, today I'm going to uh, uh, show a few things that we've done here with, um, with uh, water conservation and soil building. Uh, just a quick introduction. Uh, we're on the site of Britannia Hospital. Uh, to my, uh, uh, my right, we have, uh, there's offices here for uh, several NGOs and there's a, a doctor, people, it's kind of like a walk-in clinic. People come uh, for a consultation. There's a dentist here. Uh, it's a it's a secure site, uh, walled with uh, wire and, uh, and and security. That's the way it is in this in this area. Let's uh, let's walk inside. And uh, uh, today is, is Sunday, so we're we're uh, the activities are, are very minimal. Uh, as we uh, walk through this gate, we enter the space of. Uh, of uh, Britannia Hospital, which is uh, a site for, uh, it's a hospital for uh, malnourished children. Um, so the administration here gave me uh, the use of their basically garden space. We call it garden space. Uh, so with that, we've, uh, and maybe it's very unusual that, uh, that I would be working in agriculture with garden space, but here, uh, here we have uh, the basic uh, line of equipment for, uh, for a, a farmer in for thousands of farmers that, that work in, in this area. So it gives you an idea like uh, the dimension of what agriculture is. <coughs> um, we've, uh, with the grounds here, we've, we've established uh, uh, this uh, forage crop, which, uh, which is, uh, uh, keeps humidity, uh, helps to, to keep humidity. We're, we're in a, a, a temperature zone where we're at 30 degrees uh, pretty much all the time, maybe 28 to 35, something like that is our, is a, is our, is our range of temperature. Uh, we, we don't produce a lot of food uh, at, at this point, but this is a, a plant that's used to, to flavor, uh, flavor the beans. It's chipiline. Uh, there's several of them around here. We're letting some of them go to seed so that we can collect uh, seed off of them to, to reproduce. Um, on this side, it's, it's the same. We've uh, just a bit of decor. Uh, the area is, is, is uh, basically to, we want to create a, a, a pleasant atmosphere where, <coughs> where parents can uh, come and be with their children for a, <coughs> for a period of time while, while they're in the hospital. So uh, we're, uh, we're growing some, uh, well we will be growing some, uh, some papaya. There's a, a plant that's a, that's a papaya. There's, there's several of them around here. Um, to this side we have, uh, have uh, some malanga. Malanga is a, is a root crop like, uh, uh, like uh, uh, Yams or uh, or that kind of crop, uh, so we've we've just established that in in a, in a couple of the, the garden spaces. Uh, this side is still pretty much un, uh, undone. It's uh, <coughs> been that way for years. Uh, let's go uh, let's go further down the hill, and uh, most uh, or virtually all of the farmland in the area is on hillside slopes. Uh, we also here work on uh, with on, on hillside slopes. Uh, to to my left here we we've uh, we've established um, yams there are uh, camote it's uh, uh, these it's, it's very prolific uh, growing vegetatively very well we uh, so we've we've got this hillside established it helps to control erosion keeps humidity in and and hopefully uh, produces some some uh, some food uh, to my right here. Uh, we've we've put in a coll uh, water collection system to collect uh, uh, rainwater to uh, to use as because it, it it only rains here like about five five months of the year the rest of the year it's uh, it's it turns very dry so we've got another big um, uh, reservoir we've we've put in on on the other side of the property to uh, to collect rainwater uh, anyway we, this one is just a small one that we've put in for uh, to use for <coughs> for uh, the uh, uh, as another part of the agricultural operation with some some hogs that we we, we produce here. <coughs> uh, the as you can see the uh, the animals uh, uh, really don't like heat very well. They like to have some water to bath in. So with the rainwater we can give them a little bit of water. On right now there's none in this this pen. has got some some water in it. They they love to, uh, to just to get it to to cool off. 
So we use the, the rainwater to wash the pens down, and, and uh, then we, uh, <coughs> we, uh, we take the, the nutrients and the excrement from the, from the animals. We've established, a, 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 a installed a, a pipe that takes, uh, takes that, uh, that water with excrement down to, uh, to uh, a compost pile. Some of the water uh, gets dropped here where we irrigate a small area where, uh, where we, we, we run a, a, a flock of uh, uh, free-range uh, uh, layer birds. Uh, they're producing very well right now and doing, uh, doing very nicely. Maybe in another video I'll, <coughs> I'll do one just, uh, just on that. Uh, on this side too, we're still in the process of establishing more, uh, more yams or um, this uh, camote. I'm not sure if I've got the right word. But uh, with, with the shade conditions that we work in, it's one, one crop that, that's growing for us. We don't want to take the trees out because of the, the intense heat that we work in, so we're trying to find crops that will uh, produce at least something in, uh, in, in shady conditions. So uh, I think that's, uh, that's about it. We've also established a, a, a system where now we're using uh, the water from the laundry. To, uh, that goes down to uh, to a, an area where there's um, a clump of uh, of bamboo. Uh, the the laundry water now goes down down there, and 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 this, we've got a lot of new shoots of bamboo coming coming up. So, uh, and in, within the chicken area, we've established like uh, fruit trees. We've got lemons, oranges, um, bananas, uh, papaya. Growing with within the area where the chickens uh, produce the nutrient, nutrients, and from the hogs come the, come the the, uh, the water to irrigate. So uh, the whole process is to 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 make a, a sustainable uh, system of uh, of uh, of producing food. Uh, so we've I've been here uh, a year now on this site, and I keep thinking I should have. I, I want to add a few more things. I want to do a few more things before we do this video, and, and it just doesn't seem to end. We keep we keep adding and adding, and and so. Uh, but anyway, today this is where we're at. So, um, all right. Thank you for viewing.